tuned in. My brother was here. He's a Vietnam vet. They're trying to raise money for their post, American Legion Post 804. They're going to have the Stone Groovers Saturday, September 7th, 2013 from 8 p.m. to 12 p.m. at 4615 East Cesar Chavez Avenue, Los Angeles, California, 90022. They want, they'll be asking for donations at the door. Now, I know people are going to say, wait a minute, that's not El Monte. That's East L.A. But the veterans are everywhere, and veterans are a brotherhood. So you guys ought to help out. Those of you that are veterans or have family that are veterans, you're going to want to go check that out and help them out. The Almonte Police Department is going to have an open house Saturday, September 21st at the police station, 11333 Valley Boulevard, Almonte, California, from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m., free admission. For info, 626-898-3705. There will be station tours, live pursuits, bicycle giveaways, police displays, entertainment, and food booths. Don't miss it. So you guys want to go there. Remember, the 21st. I'll talk about the electronic waste again in a few minutes. But I don't want to do that in the same breath when I'm bringing up a, a very famous and notorious restaurant tour. So we could have Joey Duran up here, please. Let's hear it from him. Come on. There you go, boss. We've been trying to get Joey to stay on the show, mostly <laughs> when my microphone's still on. And... Uh, it's good to have you, Joey. Thank you. Thanks for inviting me again. Oh, we love having him. I mean, he's our de facto sponsor. He's part of the family now. We adopted the whole family. And uh, we want everybody down here to have a good time. And we're working on maybe possibly, well, don't tell anybody, but we want to try to have uh, some of the artists that are going to perform on uh, our good buddy Chico Manquero's new CD to uh, make uh, visit signings and, you know, CD giveaways at your place. That'd be awesome. You know, we we're uh, every Sunday night we do a uh, uh, we have a Dodger at our at our restaurant. Uh, we had Manny Mota there last week, and and by coincidence, uh, Jay Johnson came over, and it turned out to be a really cool uh, Dodger night there. Uh, this week we're having AJ Ellis, who's the current uh, uh, catcher for the Dodgers. It's going to be at ten o'clock in the morning, and we're really excited about that because uh, the the Dodger crowd comes over. We have a sports bar over there. We have nine TVs that people come out to watch the games. And uh, we're really excited about them coming over this week. Well, you know, the Impulse Band, they're going to scarf up that manual special. I'm, I'm sorry, I should have warned you. Well, well, yeah, you know, I only bought one. I should have bought more. You know, there's so many people right here, you know. I know. Well, it's a small community. Actually, they have their own yeah. zip code. But, um, <laughs> you know, but they're wonderful. Aren't they fantastic? They're people? awesome. They're awesome. It's, it's, a really, it's a really good time. I know. They're, they're tough. We know it. We love them. That's why uh, we got Ronica's taking, um, Valerie's taking some um, uh, pictures for the whole situation here. And it's going to be put up on the Facebook and all our pages and everything so you guys are gonna be people are gonna be sick of looking at you guys seriously <laughs> especially the moose family center well you know the, the councilwoman was talking about about a about a charity that she's uh, involved with and i just want to let everybody know that uh you know Altepia cafe you know opens up its restaurant uh in tradition that malcolm manuel did for many many years on tuesday uh, on mondays and wednesdays to any charitable group that would like to come in and we do fundraisers for them we give we give back uh they bring in the people. We give back 20% of the of the food that they buy uh, back to the charity. Uh, in fact, this week we're having the uh, Starlight Cheerleaders. are going to come on a Monday. Uh, we've had the uh, North Whittier uh, School over there. We've got Mill School over there. We've had several different groups that come in there. And uh, it's just part of the tradition of El Tepia, giving back to, back to the community. You know, and uh, if anybody uh, that has a charity that wants to come over, you know, give me a call. And uh, we'll put you up on there. And, and um, every Monday and Wednesday, it's a charity night. So we just want to make sure that everybody knows about that. Yeah, round of applause for this young man. We've got a lot of good people here. So that's a hero. Yeah. See, you know, that people, people walk the walk. That's what we're talking about. So, you know, and this is what it's really important. And I know that your guys' business has always helped a lot of people. I grew up in Boyle Heights, so I know uh, I can always remember that restaurant opening their heart and the doors to a lot of people there, you know, especially right after church. So that was always <laughs> wonderful. And, you know, man, I, I can't even believe it. But, you know, the food's so awesome. I mean, how do you continue the tradition of having, you know, such great food all the time? Well, you know, when, when, I, uh, when I asked Malcolm Manning to open up the uh, industry store, uh, he says, you know, Mijo, you just got to do the same, same. Make sure that everything, you know, the Chile Verde, everything is the same. You got the Hollenbeckers, everything the same. You know, there's been many people that take the Tepeyac name. You know, there's Tepeyacs all over the places, but there's only one manuals on Tepeyac in Boyle Heights. And I'm very fortunate that I got to... Uh, to have the second out Tepeyac in City of Industry. And uh, it, it's, it's been fun. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a very challenging. You know, we lost my deal manual in February. Right, right. And uh, it's been very challenging going back from number one to number two. 
And uh, but you know we're 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 happy with that. We're happy with that, and we're happy that people are coming over, and, and we're happy that the Dodgers are coming over, and we're happy that uh, we're able to do the 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 Monday and Wednesday charity. So it's it's been a lot of fun. You know it, it's uh, you know when my dear Manuel he says you know I said to man I want to open up a restaurant. And he says you know me ho. Do you like the restaurant? I said, no, you know, Tim, I love it. He says, you know, open it. Because you have to love what you do to make it work. And it, it's been fun. Well, that's, that's like our band here. They love what they're doing. That's why they that's sound right. so you good. Gotta, yeah, you guys are wonderful. You know, you love what you do, and that's what makes you successful. See? And, and my crew. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yeah, there you right. go. And that there was an unsolicited endorsement, folks. I can see no that. <laughs> Straight from the heart. Yeah. Well, my crew, my crew knows what they're doing. That's why they love telling me my mic was off. <laughs> anyway, they enjoyed it. I saw people back there in the auto control room. <laughs> yeah. But that, you know, it does happen. Uh, I'm, I'm wondering, okay, when you have the signings, do you have it like in the parking lot? Do you have it inside the restaurant proper? No, actually, actually we, we, do, we do it inside the, inside the restaurant. You know, we have them come in and, and uh, we do the signing every, every Sunday. You know, we've had Manny Motor there. We've had Bobby Castillo, who's going to be coming back. Mickey Hatch is going to come. Uh, Paulo Duca is going to come. But, but this Sunday is very special. This Sunday we have... A, a, a catcher that is currently with the Dodgers, and, and that's very special for us. And uh, anybody that, that, that's around the city that wants to come over and, and uh, you know, say, say hi um, to A.G. Alice, you know, and thank him for all the work that they're doing. You know, the Dodgers are awesome this year. You know, we, we can't have a better team than we have this year. So, you know, come, come on down and, and, and join the group. It's at 10 o'clock in the morning, 10 o'clock on Sunday morning, this Sunday. And, uh, you know, it, it's, it's really fun. You know, you come over there, you know, you get a picture. Uh, Manny Mota last week. The, Manny Mota is an awesome guy. You, you know Manny Mota. Right, right. You know Manny Mota. He has a charity that he does. So you just can be a toy, a ten dollar toy, and you come over and he'll sign anything. He'll sign a bat, he'll sign a ball, he'll sign anything that you want to do, and it's it's really kind of cool. Well, we actually had uh, we had our uh, we do several other shows besides my monstrosity here. We actually have a sports show with Louis Mendez and he. Yeah, Louis. Louis showed up this last week. Yeah, he put it on. I saw it on Facebook. I was cracking up. Man, he was grinning from ear to ear. Oh, yeah, yeah, we had, uh, like I say, uh, Manny Motos and, and uh, Jay Johnson showed up, and he had interviews with both of them, and invited them back. You know, every time that we have somebody on Sundays, he could come back oh, and, he'll be there. And, and, and do the interviews because they're, they're, they're there at Altepeac. And like I say, it's, you know, just in the, the tradition of my dear Manuel, we need to make it a fun place. You know, I don't yeah. get free shots of tequila like he did, but, you know, he, uh, we, we, we come over there. and uh, dry, folks, <laughs> just to let you know. No, we, uh, let me tell you, it's uh, with Louis Mendez. Louis Mendez, for those people who don't know him from Los Rock Angels, he, um, he actually dedicated a song to uh, Emmanuel's burrito last time he was here. He sang to the burrito, seriously. <laughs> the guy. He's in love. We got the picture. You'll see it on Facebook soon. Yeah. He was hiding in the room, cutting himself a slice. You know? Yeah, but no, no, he, he was awesome. He came over there, and he, you know, everybody was very happy to see him there, and and told me, come over do a remote. You guys should do a remote over there one of these days too. Well, we will. We, you know, like I said, that's yeah. all part of it, part of uh, part and parcel. And that's why I was asking you about the setup, because I would like to invite the Impulse Band to be there, if not be a fundraiser, be there so we could film. And that's what I was asking you: if it could be inside the, the restaurant proper, or do you guys use the parking lot? Because some places they can rope off a little area and stuff, and people can, you know. Well, you know, we we could put a little tent out there, if, you know, if it's big enough for that. But you know, we usually do it inside. Yeah. Well, they fit in here. Yeah, we do inside, and you know, in. yeah, you know, we, you know, they would fit inside the restaurant. You know, every, every uh, Thursday, Friday, and Sunday, we have mariachi corazón de Mexico that comes over there every day, and they're really awesome. You know, if you, you love mariachis, they're beautiful women from Guadalajara, and they, they come over there and they, they, they entertain everybody every week. And uh, you know, you guys, you going to come down over there? We could work something out, and it'd be it'd be really kind of cool. Yeah, because they have know. a they have a good following. I know this. For yeah. Fact, so, you know. Yeah, it'd be very cool. And I don't we, have a real big place, but you know, it, it's. It, it, it accommodates a lot of people, and, and people come through there, so it's cozy. <laughs> well, you know, two of, the, two of these kids were on my shows back in East L.A. back in the days, you know, when they were like 12 and 13, respectively. So, you know, and, and so we, it's exciting to see people and see them move on and really build themselves a real, real good attraction going on here, and you guys are doing a great job. And this man, historical, historical, his whole family, man. I mean, they're, they're iconic. I got people in the audience out nodding, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, and we'll, you know, so, we, yeah, definitely, you know, we're going to come on down. We'll set up. We'll bring the Almani Tonight crew down there. I'm sure they'll all love to go, right? We're well, you, you, you guys came for dinner the other night. It was kind of cool. Yeah, well, yeah. we had the, that was, actually, that was all our producers from all the other six shows. They were yeah. all there because we're setting up, we're actually setting up a nonprofit. So oh, really? Yeah, so we'll be doing, we'll be knocking on your door for some fundraising activities because we are going to be uh, setting up 
uh, production companies for some of the performers and some of the groups that we're working with. You know? Yeah, you know, and that's what it's all about. You know, you open you open up a restaurant and you want to give back to the community. You know, my dear, my dear Manuel, you know, every Tuesday he'd have people from Roosevelt, from Garfield, Salesian. They come in there and it was kind of cool because he would he would put one cook and they put everybody else from the from the school to come over there. And they would work. They would work the tables and 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 they would make some money doing that. So that was kind of really kind of cool. Well, it is, you know, but this is a Roosevelt show, so. <laughs> let people know okay and we know we got a lot of good friends from garfield that come up from time to time come on the show and i, and I didn't even know because i meet them here in Omani. so you know don't leave yet we have some parting shots i want the impulse band to take it off again because i love what they do it just it's energizing the, the studio i'll ask one of my interns to turn the air back on because it probably went off by now and it roasts in here man we can, we'll keep your manual special warm there you go I tell you, that was so good, man. You guys are just off off the hook. I'm taking this off because you're telling me I'm beating the table to go. So tell us, Joey, how do people get a hold of you? Remind us again the dates for the signing and how, how they can get it. There's a, you have a website, Facebook, or got something to go to? Well, th this Sunday, it's a special time. It's at 10 o'clock in the morning. A.G. Ellis will be there at 10 o'clock at uh, 13131 Crossroads Parkway in City of Industry. And uh, normally, the, the rest of the sightings are 5 o'clock on Sundays. Every Sunday, all the way through, through the fall, we're going to have a, a different Dodger. 
We're going to have Paula Duca. We're going to have Kay Landro. We're going to have um, uh, Mickey Hatchers coming up, Baba Castillo. And uh, get a hold of us at 562-695-2277. And uh, as I said a a few minutes ago, if you have a... uh, want to do a fundraiser at our, at our restaurant, please give me a call and we'll put it together and uh, it'll be a lot of fun. You know, just the, the more people you bring in, the more money you're going to get. All right. We heard it from the man himself. Let's give him a round of applause here. <laughs> Carries on the tradition. Thanks a lot, my Thank friend. You. Appreciate it. We're going to have to unmic you there. I'm going to try to do this. I don't know. Do I have enough time for this? They'll scream it at me. Yeah. Good. I, know you, I am going to come over here because we like to introduce the band whenever possible. So I'm going to start on this side. I hope you guys can follow me. Watch out with my spaghetti there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Man, it reaches, actually. Your name, dear, and where you hail from? My name is Linda Uliberry, and I'm from San Dimas, California. Okay, let's hear it for Linda. Come on. Don't be shy. You guys got to applaud for yourself. You saw, you saw Joey Duran. He applauds for himself. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. Let me try to squeeze back here. If we can get one of the interns, maybe untangle me. I'd appreciate it. This young man, he was the first to arrive and probably be the last to leave. Your name, sir, and where you hail from? My name's Danny. I'm from Rosemead. This here for Rosemead. <laughs> How long have you been playing, Danny? Uh, I've been playing music all my life. Oh, a player, huh? Okay. <laughs> well, that's good, man. I'm glad you made it. Music, music. Music, music, yeah. And this young man, come on, step Thank forward. You. This young man, he, he's a familiar face from way back. Your name, sir, and I love his name. Art. Great. And where do you hail from? East Los Angeles. Let's hear it for East Los, for the people out there, man. A lot of people out here got roots. How long have you been playing? Because I knew you were on my show back uh, when. Oh, you're going to date me, huh? No, you're not my type. <laughs> I appreciate oh, the offer. All my life. All my life. We're glad, we're glad to have you out here, boss. Okay, I got I to gotta get to the drummer because the drummers never come out. You guys are way, they're way back there. And, you know, we just see their head all the time, right? Your name, sir, and where do you hail from? Ray from Montebello. This here from Montebello. I used to teach out there. Very good neighborhood, man. So, you know, how long? Uh, where do you, are you still in Montebello now? Yes, I am. Aren't you tired yet? Not yet. <laughs> okay. Well, bless your heart, man. It's good having you out here, man. You do a great job. Oh, yeah, thank you. I'm Ray on over. I'm going to get on this side and see the best for last. Ugh, the lead singer. Okay. This young man has a lot of ideas. He's got some smarts going on. Your name, sir, and where you hail from? Dennis Uliberry from San Dimas, California. San Dimas, I sense a connection here. Let's hear for San Dimas once again. We're outnumbered. We've got two, two to one. And how long you been playing? Uh, since I was 15. So well, about two weeks? I, I wish. Yeah, don't we all? Well, thanks for coming on the show. I appreciate it. And this young man, your name, sir, and where from? Mike Pettis from uh, Temple City. It's here for Temple City. I've never had a Temple City ite on my show. And how long have you been playing, man? Do some mean conga. 75, since 1975. 1975, man. Yep. Yep. These are my new ones. Oh, these are my new ones. <laughs> he, he had to leave the other ones in the pawn shop. Okay, I appreciate it, man. <laughs> yeah, I know. Been there, done that. Okay, man. And this darling with a beautiful voice. Your name, dear, and I know you got pops in the audience, so say it loud. My name is Vivian. They call me Vivi. I've been with the Impulse Band for almost eight years. I've been singing for quite a long time. I used to sing when I was 10 years old. And I grew up in East L.A. I moved to El Monte. I lived in El Monte for a good seven years. So I know what El Monte is all about. It's a great town. But unfortunately, I had to move back home with my dad to Rosemead. So now I live in Rosemead. All right, let's hear for the gypsy. We love it, man. She's been everywhere. Well, bless your heart, man. You do a great job. And she was on one of my shows, too, way back when. So, you know, I won't say my age. Otherwise, he's going to want to date me. Anyway, so everybody, individually and collectively, this is the Impulse Band. You want to go on the 24th? You want to go to the Moose Family Center? They'll be performing roughly around 8 o'clock. What's the address? Let me grab it real quick, unless somebody knows it off the top. I know it's in here. Here it is. So you guys will know. It is in El Monte, folks. It is at 4229 North Peck Road, El Monte, 91733. The phone number there, 626-422-1025. Everyone's welcome. Free admission. It'll be the 13th Annual Antique Car and Motorcycle Show. So you're going to have a great time, dance concert, and you get to see these wonderful, lovely people do their thing. And 
they're even better in person. Trust. Okay? So I think we're running close to the end of the show. How much time we got back there? Ten. Ten minutes? Perfect. I know you guys have a ten-minute song, right? So I'm going to close off the show. One of my people, once again, resource uh, fair this Saturday, the 24th, at uh, the Amani Valley Mall. Go there early. It starts at 8. Be there early. Get some backpacks. Get some uh, pencils, some socks, all kinds of good stuff for your kids, man. There's no shame in that. It's brought to you by your own uh, fellow citizens, your businesses that are supporting you. You want to go out there, support them, participate. And when you see the council members, go up there, shake their hand, and thank them. And just tell them, hey, introduce yourself. No problem, because we're all in this together. So you want to be able to participate in that. So please, please, get there early. Enjoy yourself. Just for the City of Almonte schools, okay? The Union High School District, the city schools, Mountain View. Those are the people who want to help out because this is our community, and we want everybody to benefit from that. And Councilwoman Vicky said it straight out, first come, first serve. So you want to get down there. Okay, Arturo Esparza, of course, is Almonte tonight. Don't forget manuals, the signing, 10 o'clock this Sunday. Be there early so you get a chance to meet one of our championship Dodgers in person. So you want to be able to do that and support uh, the El Tepeyac Manuals Cafe, wonderful people, icons of the community. And I want to thank all my people in here, in, in the crew. You're going to have to shout out your names. First one, Jason. Jason. David. David. Yeah. Sophia. Sophia. Oh, Jamie, I know. We got Silk in the back. Clarissa, I know. I just like calling her Silk because she's so smooth. I want to thank Pops. Thank you, Pops. And Jose for coming on in and sitting down and enjoying the show wearing a tie. Love it. And, of course, Valerie, the one and only Nobaloni. So we love you all. You guys, take care. Do not drink and drive. I'm I tonight. We'll see you next month. Take it away. Impulse Band.
of flowers. 